One Owner Car Guy, OneOwnerCarGuy.com, and this is my thousandth video. Uh, that's a lot of videos. And I got to thinking about it more and more as people started mentioning, what are you doing for your thousandth video? I figured, I better get my butt to work. So, got something here. It's a long video. There's a lot of stuff in it. But this is the prize package that you could win in a video. From there, not winning my machine. My little bingo machine. That's mine. And you can see all the marshmallows you're going to get. The tab, pimp juice, muscle milk, freebie in there, cards, three. Oh, man, I'm not going over it all. You're going to get this, but you'll notice it disappears during the video. It disappears because I ate it. And you won't see that, but you're going to get one. So check it all out. Thanks for watching. I really have enjoyed talking to everybody on here. Commenting when you comment in the uh, down below there in the thing, that's awesome. I enjoy responding and getting to know everybody. It's awesome. Like my videos, share my videos to where your friends can see them. It really helps my videos out, and I really appreciate it. Um, other than that, play this contest. Here comes some stuff about it. I clipped this stuff together kind of different and oddly because it was I don't know what I'm doing with the editing software too good. And I'm just doing it all by myself. I don't have any help doing it. I'm just editing videos. It's fun. YouTube's great. Thanks, YouTube. Check all this out. First three minutes of the show here, show, film, whatever you want to call it, it's going to be just kind of clips of before and stuff from this year and stuff coming up in the next videos. There's Breeder on there, of course. Um, cars, of course. The charity website, NathanRadislaw.org. You can check that out. Beaglespocket.org. Dot, dot com. And that one there, you can get to a lot of my sites through. I just put up clickwebs.com. If you're a YouTube partner or business owner, you don't have a website, easy, quick way to get online. Simple website building. You can control it yourself. I'll give you all the know-how and everything. It's super easy, super simple. Get more hits, get more subscribers, get more clients. I don't know. Check out these three minutes with me. Um, and then I'm going to show you some more stuff. I've got a walk around. I've got a car. Oh, man, we got some cool stuff. The contest. Celebrity contest. Make sure and make your guess. Lots of clues and tips coming up. There are clues and tips that were in my last videos that if you've been watching are going to help you win the bonus prizes and stuff. Huge prizes. Huge, I said. And not only that, there's going to be a lot of contests this year. A lot of them. And um, I'm feeling really stupid about that last thing there, but there's no retakes, man. We're just putting this out real. I ain't got time to do no dang retakes. So lots of contests and stuff. If you've been paying attention, huge prizes. SodaStream.com is one of the things. Go to in my link in my description down here. You get a coupon. I give a coupon away at that. Um, I'm buying SodaStream. Lots of SodaStream stock. I like the stock on StockGambles.com. OneOwnerCarGuy.com for the one owner cars. Check out this three minutes here, just kind of a clip of all kinds of stuff, and we'll get into this, and I got stuff to give away. Thanks for watching, and it's been a fun couple years here. Hopefully a lot more stuff coming up. Make sure to subscribe, like, comment. I love talking to people on here, and here we go. One owner car guy, and you know I'm excited about this one if you watch my channel much. This right here is a 1995 Mercedes. <laughs> There's just no need for that kind of stuff. I wonder if you have to open that valve if it opens itself. I'll bet you it tells you in there. I don't want to know. Just flip this out here, and he just got back, actually, from visiting with Tony Gwynn, and has just got a stack of them signed, and has a special deal with a fundraiser for the Highway Patrol here in California, and they'll be selling them. And actually, if you were interested in one, I could probably talk to him. Do you know if they sell them if you... These are for giveaways for uh, their Christmas party. Boom! It's been placed. Let's hear the click. Give me the click. Click. And that's it. It's placed. Soda Stream International. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, that's it, dude. I'm telling you. That's the premium stuff. That's people food there, buddy. Oh, yeah. Why? Is somebody just on drugs and doesn't want to do anything? I mean, is it just a sincere problem? I mean, I don't know all them things, and I'm definitely in the mode to hell. It's cold out. It's definitely cold out. Um, why aren't you staying with your mom? Uh, just stay. You know, they gave me like a year to get a job and stuff. How long have you been in I San Diego? I can go there and like, get clean clothes, shower and stuff. I've been in San Diego, this is actually the first 
first full year I've been here. You've been here a whole year? Yeah. I came out about three years ago. <laughs> He's like, it's my ass. <laughs> that is so funny. I'll tell you what, that's the most she's been around other dogs like that ever. Oh, wow. It's amazing. And she's what? A year and a half? Uh, about 18, 16 years. Well, Hi, they're buddy. Perfect, because they're both about two years old. He's almost two. He's just he's turned two. Oh, you're a pretty dog. You're a good dog, huh? <laughs> That's what it smells like. And kind of what it tastes like. I like mm -hmm. this. Grasshoppers. That's really good. Almost just under 30,000 work for a ton of dogs. But you know, yeah. people got to look at the potential. For How much is the bingo machine? How much for the bingo machine? The bingo machine is a dollar. Bingo. <laughs> you bought it. Damn it, now you're gonna make us have to carry that out of here? <gasps> What's up, Meryl? What's up? This is Cat, and you may, he wants to show his butt to the whole world. You may have seen him. One owner car guy, and that was the three minutes of clips from last year couple clips coming up from the next month or so. I got my soda stream machine here. And if you go to my new site, ClickWebs, on there I'm going to put a link right in it to where you can get free shipping and there's a little thing you get uh, money off of it and the whole deal. Great machine. I got the water in it already. Come up close on where you can see this. It definitely does some bubbles and talk about saving money. Not only will you save money on the drink, you'll save money on the bottle tax. It charges so much for bottle tax. And what I got here is probably the one that will save you the most. It's the energy drink. And they compare to different brand names. I've never tried it. Um, I will be honest with you, I have tried almost every one out there. Ooh, it's a nice thick syrup. Wow. It's got a good energy drink smell to it. And I was the main distributor in Montana for Nelly's Pimp Juice. And you get one of these with the prize. Got lots of prizes were thrown in with this. And the way they mix it, which I couldn't believe, is by shaking it. it. Says it right on the instructions, man. I know I'm doing right. So, gonna try that out. I always hate opening this after shaking it. But it usually works out just about right. I'm probably not supposed to carbonate it with the ice in there. But, nonetheless, I did. That's good, you're gonna try it. Probably kind of like, but a little bit better than the bullet that they have over in Netherlands. Can you flip another cup over? And definitely close to Red Bull type taste. Now, if you want something that makes it kind of healthy, this here Bolt House Farm stuff is so good. And not only is it so good, let mom try that and we'll put some of this in hers. Number one, it's 100% juice. It's a smoothie, high calorie because it's got good carbs, lots of good carbs. And look at that fiber. And sure, some comes from sugars, lots of it comes from sugars. A good amount of it comes from the fiber though. But this is definitely the good kind of sugars and good kind of carbs. And a really good mix of pretty much depending on how you like it. 50-50 something to that effect. That's good. So, for prizes for this contest you're going to have to pay attention. Celebrity contest. 
and there's going to be a bunch of rambling on about all this different stuff and soda stream and different things just kind of a preview of what's happening on the channel and how it's happening um, if you get all the questions right you're going to win all this there's bonus round questions and you're going to win one of them that's why you're watching this thing about the soda boost because you're going to win one well you might win one first off it's a celebrity contest so basically you're going to have to guess the celebrity and there's a car that's in the walk around that I'm putting in this movie and you're going to see that car and you're going to be oh wow that's pretty cool and I'm going to be like hey this is pretty cool and all that good stuff you're going to have to guess whose it is that's part of it you guess whose it is first one you get bunches of cereal marshmallows bunches you get the new chocolate cereal marshmallows that we just got in don't even have on the sites yet you get the vanilla ones you get them all you're going to get a collector's can of pimp juice. Don't drink it. Don't drink the pimp juice. It's just a little bit expired. But I kept them around for souvenirs. You're going to get tab. Because you see it on this channel. And I get so many questions of what is that? Or how does it taste? Same thing on muscle milk. Great drinks. You're going to get King Lifestyles Premium Large Condoms. Because you just may need some premium large condoms laying around sometimes. You just never know when that might come in handy. You're going to get three sets 1988, 1989, 1990. Complete sets, every card, like 660 in that one, 704 in that one. And over here, I kind of got it set up. Rookies. There is so many rookies, I don't know them all. And it's just been a long time. But Sammy Sosa. I'm looking for my little mouse to where I can scroll. This is just one year. And these are some of the rookies that are in that set. Sean Holman, Kelly Mann, Larry Walker, Juan Gonzalez, I mean, Delano DeShields, David Justice Rookie. I mean, all these in this. I mean, you probably see a lot more. Mo Vaughn, I mean, Ben McDonald. Some of these were supposed to be a lot bigger than they were the two. Supposed to be really good, and some of them weren't. There's the other year. Just all kinds of stars that from yesteryear. You never know what this stuff's going to be worth. Um, so, three sets. I went over two quickly. Also, score supplemental set, 89 score football. Who's the rookies in this? I don't remember. But you know, you get a lot of rookies in here. Sterling Sharp, I think, was a rookie. This was a rookie year. It was a traded year for Elway. Um, lots of different rookies in here. This is where all some of these cool cars are going to be coming from in the future years. So, four complete sets. You're going to get some wax packs, just for the heck of it. Here's some wax packs. I'm throwing them in. You're going to get the G.I. Joe trading cards. But call now. No, none of that. You're going to get the, the apple fruit that you've seen on the channel. And I'm going to be doing reviews of all the different ones for the hardener stuff. So, answer the main... And the Subway card. I think Subway is going to be the one it is. You're going to get all kinds of sandwiches. So you're going to have food. All kinds of food. Take the family out. You're going to have all kinds of marshmallows. You're going to have all just a tab and a muscle milk to try. You got 24 pokes. I mean, 24 pokes. Now, I'm giving you true value. This is free. You got three sets of baseball cards that could go through the roof. One card could be, oh man, I don't even want to get into it. It's just, what's in here? I don't know. Actually, I do know. You don't know. And you won't know till it shows up. Also, on top of this kind of stuff that I'm throwing in, including the food and all that and the rubbers and everything, you're going to get some special things that I throw in from my whole goodies bin that you don't even know what they are. They're collectible, they're valuable, and they are investment type things that you might enjoy. And I put it in there just depending on who you are and who wins and maybe something I think you might like. Stage one, you pick the guy who, who owned this thing. You pick the girl who owned this thing before me. You got it. It could have been a dog that owned it. Pick who owned the car. Is it a car? No, it's something else. And you're going to see it in the video. Watch for that. On this, there's extras you have to get. And you're going to have to pay attention on the video, and then you'll get a soda stream machine. Plain and simple, no strings attached, anything like that. That's pretty much the whole deal. While I was here, I had this pulled up. In any of my videos, when you're in there, you can go to my channel simply by clicking under the video on cereal marshmallows. And not only that, click like. It really helps me. If you like my video, like it. 
it really does help out and it pushes it up the thing a little bit. Comment. I love talking to everybody on here. I try really hard to get back to 99% of all the people, the trolls. I try not to answer too many of them and get pulled into it. You'll see web pages up in this corner. And if you click on this one, you can go subscribe and check that out. So, well, oh, and ads, if they pop up, you can click this right here on the little X and get rid of them so you don't have to watch them if you're not interested. So, that's that. That's that. Gonna drink my juice. Got everything going on. I think I mentioned what it is here. So pick the superstar, pick the actress, pick the whatever kind of person they were. I don't know. Could have been a basketball player. I know. You don't know. So pick all that. And that is the middle of this here video. You know most of the stuff. I'm going to add in this here walk around. There'll be clues. There'll be stuff. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. One owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. Don't know what kind of a how long or where this video will be, but this one's sold. This one's sold. Um, this one is not. Full review on my channel. I'm going to do a full walk around of my lot. Um, still got the Jimmy. Still got my Jimmy. Got that one is sold. The 280. Hey! Somebody threw an egg at it. Got to get that off right away. I uh, got the Honda Civic still. I like that car, it's pretty cool. GTO, had that for 20 something years. Um, little 78 Civic. Civic? Celica liftback. And beautiful little manual car. Make you deal, full review on my channel. Mercur, make you deal, full review on my channel. 46 Ford, just got everything all done on it. Um, had to retap a few of the holes for the screws to get that latch to work. Make you a great deal on it. Nice car. Breeder, not a great deal on her. She would be too much. Not for sale. NFS. Well, give a quick walk around outside and just thousandth video. <clears throat> People ask me, what are you going to do for the thousandth video? Then they really started asking me. Then they really started asking. Well, I didn't know. I still don't. Um, Brooklyn. Nice car. Gold wing. I still got the Peugeot for sale. 504. Make it a deal. Full review on that one, but not on the Brooklyn. Um, this one, I just got done with the inside. I don't think I'm going to paint it or nothing. It's in good shape. A few dings and dents here and there. But I got the seats redone. Look at that. <whistles> then I got it back, and I didn't like how the carpets looked. Couldn't believe it, I didn't get the carpets done, so I got the carpets redone. Oh man, this truck is nice. No oh, listen to that. Haven't got a review of this up yet, but I'm gonna kind of show the ones that I don't have a full review up of how clean they are to where you can see. I do get a lot of people asking about this stuff, and then I don't have what it takes to show them. Uh, 57 Mercedes-Benz 220S and this has a um, 90s model 300E in it motor 3.0 great shape clean car this one is sold 73 convertible haven't done a review yet it's almost ready to go super clean down low, up high. Oh yeah, parts car, parts car. Unless you get this in the next three to five days, it's sold, 23,000 mile Skylark. I'm gonna use it for one of my employees, guys, that wants a car like this. Low mile, good gas mileage. I'll sell this like it is. They pop that back, bent that tire at the auction, smashed stuff up a little bit, but it's a manual. SC baby. Middle of the seats is kind of tore up. Lower mile car just sat in the sun. Snowmobiles. I'll make you a deal on the two of them. Sold the gold coupe. This thing is just set here and collected dust because I can't get the ignition fixed. Don't have a review of that. Great shape. Lots of dust. Interior just beautiful. Clear coat burn on the top. Euro model, 
81,000 original miles. All kinds of stuff up top. I can show down low. I'll take uh, 750 bucks for the Bonneville SSE supercharged car. This one's sold. That one's done being painted and it'll be coming up pretty soon. 130 or so on it. 6.9, baby. 6.9. Euro model 6.9. And very nice at that, might I add. Ooh, I like the shade. Hey, and of course that one's locked. The shade shows everything so much better, though. Very clean car. Paint's faded, of course. Euro model 500 SL. We're gonna go around. I'm gonna part that one out, I believe. The van I'm getting the tire fixed on, just got the seats done, 71 Econoline. Make you a great deal, super clean. All around the fender wells, all original. Everything just super clean, miscellaneous dings. Little dense paint wearing thin, but we're talking original paint. Funny thing is, this one had a um, black plate. That's not funny. Mazda hubcaps is kind of funny though. Ford and Mazda didn't share that far back. 71. Mission information right on the side window there. Like I said, I got these seats redone. My guy's good. Super clean little all original kind of line. Three on the tree. I've had somebody asking about pictures of this. I don't have any. I just dumped it back here without taking any. And this ain't the way to take pictures. It's clean. It's not all rusty. Nothing like that. Very clean project it's a total project back spoilers not split away from it yet like they did you know he bumped it a little there it's a crack in it right there not a spoiler but I can't if you want to buy it from a video like this great I'm not it's a hard top rare in these most of them were teeth you can see the split right there in that part interior is not super clean it's here it's nice but it's just been sitting it's got a head gasket problem something over there 174 on it gonna be parts corona full review on my channel super low miles 52,000 original miles super cool little toyota corona <sighs> these wheels are valuable they're hubcap covers Nice car. 560 SEL. Gonna get that one done. Um, actually, this one's sold. Ha! Ah, that's the wrong car. Yeah, this one's sold. 86. Nice car. Got the radar. Show the Range Rover on the way out. The Porsche. This is a nice car. Full review on my channel. There was a full review of that too, but it's sold. That's the one I thought it was. Has the bad windshield. I'm gonna have this detailed out. Oh, soon. How's that? Soon. Beautiful red interior, maroon interior. Beautiful car, very rare color combo. The outside and the inside make this one very unique. Um, I gotta get that fixed before the next rain. 7123 Lincoln. Caddy limo. Haven't done anything on that. Uh, I'm gonna show you down the sides of the Lincoln. Just how clean it is. I think I got the skirts inside. I love the way these bumpers fit in. All the trim is in great shape. Great California car. <clears throat> Dent. It's just a quickie. Not all rusted out around the windows or anything. Needs a new top though. New vinyl top. Super clean. Super, super clean. Oh, and the doors closed nicely. Great driver. 460, I believe. 71, I believe. Caddy Fleetwood factory limo. Three row. Needs a restoration. AC in the back. The doors open and close nicely. CRX, a little low on that air on that tire. 
good little car, 87,000. Miscellaneous blinkers and stuff are missing. Miscellaneous little, this is out farther than it should be type things. Haven't even looked at adjusting nothing. Haven't looked at doing nothing to the inside. 83,000 miles, five speed, cheap. Make you a great deal. Great little CRX. 635 BMW. Clear coat peeled on all the top surface. Surface. And right around there is the worst of it. And that piece is a little loose. That size look good. 53,000 or 63,000? I don't know. Okay, let's look. 67. Wrong and wrong. The seats are still very nice and cushy. Oh man. Car runs great. Cheap. I will sell this car so cheap, it's pitiful. Here, this one here, special for the thousandth video. Um, sixteen hundred bucks. Super low. Fifteen hundred bucks. Fourteen ninety-five is what I'll take on that car. Export only out of California. Uh, the six thirty-five. Um, I don't know. Eighteen hundred bucks. Oh man. 67 Jeep Wagoneer. Very nice truck. Not all rusty. I'm going to go around it a little bit. Show you just around it. Not all rusty. Here's the worst of it right there. Needs new tires, of course. Patina on the roof from where the paint was faded. Not rusted through or nothing. Clean truck. I love the way the dashes look over there. Corolla 82. Oh, 45,000 original miles. Another Seville. Full review of the Corolla on my channel. I love one owner low mile cars. This one's nice too. If you need parts, I'll be parting out a few of these. God, I'd sell you this one. You want this car? Send it out of here. Um, you got to buy new tires, a couple things like that. Probably take your pick of this one or the blue one over there I showed you. Um, not all rusty. This one's got a little bit of a crinkle in it, but the interior's a little cleaner. And the top is cleaner on this one, meaning the top is nice and not corroded around the same way. But take your pick. Um, I like the wheels on this one too. And Michelin tires. Take um, 850 for either one. Catalina 455 wagon. Got that one on my website. Full review. Uh, make you a great deal. Satellite Fury, Plymouth Fury. 318, 360, one or the other. It says 360. I think it's a 318. Cash money, green dollar bills. Give me 1495. Actually, thousand video special. 1350 bucks right here. And that's that. Dodge. Just got that patina on top. It's a dart. It's a push button. Oh, I got this one locked. That's all right. Not all rusted through or nothing. Love that GT hood. I love these GT seats. Convertible. I want to restore this one. 66 Lincoln? 62, I don't know. Four door, make a great deal. Little bump here or there. Not rusty at all, have all the trim, have the surround trim inside. Just little stuff like this. It's in really good shape. I just brought this over to do, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I want to paint it, that's what I want to do. I want to just paint it. So, just got this buffed out. Looks great too. Um, this one will be coming up. It's a rally, brand new G30. It's a brand new motor and tranny he just had put in. Buick Wildcat, full review on the channel. Um, broken on that bottom spoiler down there. Might look at fixing that. 300D turbo, make you a great deal on this. Has not had the um, recall for the, oh, trap oxidizer. Hasn't had that done yet. 
So you can get that done. Maybe even a new turbo and a new exhaust. Take 3,600 bucks for that car. I love the insides of these, this era of a lazy days. Really do. Looking good. I want to just sit down and rest. Well, that's that. All the records. All the covers. Oh. Might redo that seat. I've shown some of this in walk arounds, um, but I never really show complete. For the thousandth, after everything, I figured I'd just throw this in. I don't know exactly how I'll do it. Saab Sonnet, $14.95. It's such an investment. Such a rare car, great to have. Price for Fifth Avenue, make you a great deal. Um, one owner, super low miles. Pillow top seats and such. Oh man, full review on my channel. This one's a nice car. <laughs> 300 SD, I'm gonna part it out. Suburban, 85, it's coming up. Showed you the Dodge. I didn't show you that 190E, but there's a full review on my channel. Last year, model 93. Um, I guess from there, you can see the Suburban and how clean it is. This only has little dings. Totally clean. Nice tires. Little titties all over the sides and everything. Super clean. I replaced the front seat with a tan one because it was a little tore on the driver's side. Rear air. Fully optioned. All powered out, 85. 79 DeVille. Got the tire on it now, finally. Um, this is a good deal. Um, these always break. Clean car. Give me 1,350 bucks. That's right, 1,350 bucks. Um, anything in California costs hundreds more. You gotta pay tax and you gotta smog it and get all the inspections done and all that. So that's why I say export only on these prices on some of them. Um, I actually got a, um, a lot of these, just cheap. This two-wheel drive, Cherokee, manual, oh man, it's banged up on the sides a little bit. It's got some clear coat issues, but it's a good driver and cheap, cheap. Kick it out of the state here, oh, 2100 bucks. Look at these tires. Hang cooks. 68 Ford F250. I got a review on my channel. Bad carburetor. 300E Mercedes. Got a lot of E's. Make a deal on this. One owner. Got a little bit of upper engine noise. Manual. I took the shifter off of it. 101. Uh, salvage title. He bumped it on the other side. Yeah. That's what cost him. Easier than arguing with him just to pay him off, I guess. So, deal on this. Oh man. 1950 bucks. What a deal. I don't even want to think about that. The way we're going to do this, I'm going to walk around the back and then I'm going to come out and show you what's behind me. 90 or 91 Range Rover. Uh, good rig. Nice, clean, low mile, bad tranny. 121,000 on it, black. This I'll sell cheap. Just put a wheel bearing. Um, 101 or 120, I don't know. Um, one owner, good driver. Chinook, if you're interested. I've been working on it for a while. New International. Not new, new to me. Clean, clean, clean. Scout 2 XL. Are those longer? That's how clean that is. Right above the wheel wells, the only part. Clean on the seams. Clean in the back. Just a nice rig. Look at that seats, vinyl. Seats and the wheel cover, even got the factory wheel cover back there. Yeah, baby. No wear, 
Just so clean. Odd dashes they gave us. It's a woody package with the air conditioning. Huh, this was a look at that shifter down there. This was a highly custom model. I think. Look at the headliner. It's in great shape. This thing was hardly driven. Can you take the top off of these? I think you can. Yeah, the whole top though, right? I don't know. I don't know. I believe so. Right up to the front. Yeah. I believe so. I don't think it's ever been off this one. Around the seam looks great. I got this off. Make a great deal on. Well, little miscellaneous dings. Great truck. I've done a lot of these over time, showed them to you. Got the 300E manual. I might do something with the paint. No full review of it. Clear coat faded all over the top. Interior nice and clean. Manual. A little rip in the lumbar support over there. I can get that fixed cheap. 145 on it. Manual. Fifth wheel, make a great deal on it. If you're looking for something like this, I've used it for lot security and such, and it's clean. Just lost my shoe, just like that. Nice floor setup, actually. A floor plan, I guess you would say. Callaway Range Rover. S500, 84,000, I don't know how many miles, not many, 95 model, great shave, one owner, very clean, I'll have it up soon, I stole the grill on it, put in a different car, this is the one that we just had a while back, that's what happened, yeah, that grill went in this car. To where we could make sure it matched the proper lineup here. It's in great shape. As you can see, we painted on the top of it where the clear coat was burnt. On the window sticker, it says silver. Man, it's as gold as it gets. The Aztec, I didn't show it on this walker one. I showed it in a video I made earlier. I don't know the order of what they're coming up in. 17 inch wheels factory on the rally model, 3400. Super rare, last year model. If you're looking for one of these, you won't find a cleaner one. And man, they, they, they bent their door hinge and dinked their fender. That's all that was wrong with this car. Car, truck, SUV, CUV. This one you really don't know what to call. Hand knitted covers for all the seat things there. Somebody loved this and took care of it. It's got the Rollout package tray. I had a line on a camping tent to boot also, which I'd really like to get um, to have them both. Lexus has a bad catalytic converter. Just haven't got it done yet. Um, Grand Prix. Just got it in a while back. You might have seen it in a walk around. One owner. Clean. This is the only thing wrong with it. Haven't decided if I'm gonna replace the hood yet. We'll just leave it for somebody else. Super clean, one owner. This is really clean too. I know I said one owner like three times. Make you a deal on this. 120, 130 on it. Bad catalytic. Catalytic, catalytic. Need to haul something? Diesel. E350, baby. Well, that has been a couple videos. Now I'm gonna go ahead and show you upstairs, but before I do that, I'm going to go ahead and show you in here. This here is a 03, 04, I don't know what it is. Workhorse forward control chassis is what it actually is. Um, has a Winnebago sticker in a couple places, but this thing was totally gutted. It is no longer a Winnebago. And we're getting the leveling going on to where we can get the slide outs working. Double slide. All kinds of compartments. It was wrapped. 
Wait till you see this. Yeah, baby. Now, I don't know exactly how it was set up. Oh, I know. That's a camera. It seems like these were under these where you could see yourself and design something? I don't know. Guitars were displayed. Very slick with the wood flooring and all. And it's got a head in it. A head? I think that's what it's called. Don't want to get behind. Actual air up there, but actual true air, residential central heating and air conditioning actually got the extra one back under there. It actually has solar also. Double slide with this out, this living room. It's just amazing. Love these couches. Now, here's the contest part. Um, look at all the track lighting and stuff, Pioneer. Um, this was somebody famous's. It is a nice runner too. My dad just brought it down from um, Hollywood, LA type area. Well, that's that. Thanks for watching this. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and be done with the interior here. Oh, we gotta have stuff on. Awesome stuff. And I guess the contest is gonna be a huge prize, huge prize. And I didn't exactly start this off that way and I don't know what the thousand video is going to be and all that or how I'm going to put this together so you're going to have to watch something to figure out what the prize is and I'm going to throw that all in here and I'm going to ask you for specifics towards the end of this one or as I clip other videos in so to win this time you're going to have to watch me ramble on for an awfully long time well one owner car guy we're heading upstairs I'm going to kind of show you some stuff up there I'm going to see if we have anything that I should show downstairs um, to kind of give you the idea. So, cool old coop. And yeah, it's got dings and dents and such. Interior's clean. When I say interior's clean, I mean, look at that. Plus, <laughs> floor shift manual. I want it for the part. I want it for the parts. Cool little 190. Obvious damage. Cheap. That, I don't know if I can sell it. X is driving it back to Montana again. Again! We went seven times. It runs. That runs. Check out the peel out video I did on it. Can we open up below? 99. 36,000 original miles. We're going to open up down below to where you can see there. And Bronco got the Bronco 77. Awesome truck. Is Trent still here? No, sir. It's in great shape. Grand Am 93 model SE 48,000 original miles with the white wheels and all that. 48,000 miles. Speaking of low miles, wouldn't that hurt landing on your foot? Wow. I am 99% sure that is original, 7,000 original mile Concours. Just did a review on it, basically a Nova 77 model. You'll love it. Check out the full review. The, um, this is junk. If you need parts from a cutlass wagon, I got them. If you need a cutlass convertible, that's 36,000 miles also. Great deal, cheap. Thank you, deal. Thunderbird, full review of this one and this one on my channel. That one I don't have, got another Mercur. This one, full review on my channel. Um, the Chevy is sold. The LTD, just got the full review up. 
beautiful car. That F250, I almost forgot about back here. Full review, cheap, yellow van. Just so going to UK, and the guy is making an A-Team van. Awesome, dude. This one here is clean. I don't have any video up of it, really. Um, got some little corrosion starting around the doors, as you can see, in the back there. Not much back in the back. Lips are good. Clean around the window. Clean car. Just that common area where they'll get it. Must make you a great deal on it. Dash has got some. As you see there, I think that could cut off. LTD is beautiful. I'm gonna go for the rest of this. I ain't got much more battery left. Cavalier, special, right now. Low mile, good runner. 1600 bucks. This here, great little wagon, good runner. I got a full review of this on my channel and that. Um, I'll take 1600 for each. That's sold going overseas. Datsun, cheap. This, super special, bad catalytic converter. Ship it on out, 2100 bucks. Full review on my channel, great Fleetwood. Awesome high top E150, great van. Ship it out, get it out of here. Um, 1675 bucks. Woo! V12 SL600. Cool little car. Honda, haven't done much to it. It's clean, it's straight, it ain't all rusty. In the least, got some dings, dents. Here and there and everywhere. Well, not really here and there and everywhere. Just got a few. Cheap. Get it out of here. 1250 bucks. This great Bonneville. It's got its little uniqueness and its problems. It's not perfect. Um, get it out of here. Ship it on out. 750 bucks. This, get it out of here. Nice 280 SEL. Check my site for it. Um, full review on my channel and my website. Um, OneOwnerCarGuy.com. This one here, get it out of here, 2150 bucks. Haven't got that up yet, haven't got that up yet. Clean little vet with the gaudy wheels. We'll make you a deal on it for sure. Clean little Starfire, make you a deal on that. When I get rid of it, that's sold. Wow, he ain't picked that up yet. Make you a deal on this, 1650. 50,000 original mile government van, not for sale right now. 1350 bucks for this wagon. Le Mans Safari Pontiac. It takes 1600 bucks for the Concorde with the tick knock rod and motor bad. Fairmont, 3500 bucks. I gotta get rid of this one. This one is at the end of its cycle with me. If they're not gone in about four or five months, I start really dumping them. That, that Mustang, full review on my channel. That, full review on my channel. Um, I'll take 1400 for the Mercedes and I'll take um, 2500 for that Mustang. 1,000 video special, 2150, 1,000 video special right there on that caddy. Okay, well, um, 86, 90, oh, 84, 94, Chevy G20 van, full review of my channel. Limited, or whatever the package is. Limited, yeah. Cool van, solar, whole deal. Well, she opened it up down there, so I'm going to go down and show you the downstairs. Lots of clean and unique cars. Whose was that trailer? I'm going to add in some different stuff. Give you Hi, Breeder! She's like, what are you doing? Got this one down here getting some paint. I'm going to have to do a walk through here. Actually got two of mine in there. Getting worked on, you can see. And this one we're going to do some paint on. 16,000 original miles. Check this out. Super cool. That's my 600 over there. So, gonna go back here and check out all the different cars in the downstairs part. I don't even know how I'll bring all this in but I know that I'm gonna check them out, and that's for sure. 
parts, parts, and more parts. Parts heaven, as it would seem. W123, what the heck is that? Looks like a motor for a snowmobile. Man, we got Cadillac, we got windshield, we got back shields. It's just a plethora of parts. And I got more of this junk coming too. That's all there is to it. <laughs> you need parts, let me know. I might actually have the parts you need, that's no doubt. 500 SEL, I'm gonna sell this one cheap. Um, special here on YouTube. Check the full review on my channel. It's an 8485 uh, pre facelift. I'll take 1850 bucks. Uh, Maroon 928S. Look at the 66 um, Jaguar. 420 or 4.2. I don't know what these things are called. I lose track of all these things, and that's for sure. And doing ad libs and thinking about what I'm doing next and if all that music next door is too loud, definitely gets me thinking about too many things. So I'm going to cut this off when I walk outside. We'll go film the other thing and then head out of here. Thanks for watching. Here we go. I'll see you in a second. Parts, parts, and more parts. And here's the other under, under the ground vault. That I haven't sold yet. I keep forgetting about it. Look at that. Guy came from Germany, I believe. Um, nice, low mile, clean, 68,000 mile, baby LTD, 85 mile, young timer, get this thing out of here, ship it overseas is where it deserves to be, nice Pontiac 6000, coupe 63,000, obvious clear coat issues, but cheap, 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 in fact, I think I'm giving that, we're going to do a deal with one of my other guys that works around here. Full review on that on the channel. So there's three with a full review. The two I don't have is I don't have this Range Rover with a flat tire. County long wheelbase, and I'm putting some different parts on it there. And I gotta ask them what they're doing to maintain what we're doing on it. And I'm doing something else on this one. I know there was a Cadillac converter. Kind of a thing that happens a lot around here. Supercharged V8, nice car, beautiful XJR. And I got the window sticker and everything. One owner. That seats on these Jags do that a lot. What was the price? Where is the price? Bam. 70 grand. Okay, let's head back upstairs and check that out. Lots of cool cars underground, overground, wherever. You just name it, they've got them. Um, you can check out my website, the oneownercarguy.com. Other than that, check out the Beagle websites, beaglespocket.com, hardner.com for, for health and fitness, and not only that, stock gambles for all your financial and stock and all that kind of stuff. That is a walk around. I'm not gonna try and thumb around on what I'm gonna add in for the contest right now. I'm gonna add that on, because that is a half hour of walking around showing stuff. Hi, Breeder. How you doing, girl? Beaglespocket.com, tinybeagles.com, 65 GTO convertible, four speed tri power, paraglider, hot air balloon, Mandy's not for sale, speakers, and all that good stuff. Thanks for watching. Have a great day or night, whatever it is, wherever you are. What do you think? We'll see you. Well, that was that. And hopefully, you've seen the motorhome, coach, or whatever you want to call it. That is what this is all about. And at least I told you that. Now you can go back and pick that out if you didn't catch on that that's what I'm looking for here. So, what surprises? I showed them to you. I'm going to show them to you again, and I'm going to tell you how to qualify to get the extra bonus prize, which is the Soda Street Machine. OneOwnerCarGuy.com. Back to your prizes. That's it, man. Right to the rubbers. Get the rubbers first. You might even use them first. I doubt that. First thing you do when you open it, you're gonna try these cereal marshmallows. You're gonna love them, I'm telling you. In your coffee, in your, oh, in the oatmeal, you name it, different cereals. Great stuff. Save money, I'm gonna save you so much money with this soda stream machine. And you know, in the description, right down in there, you can go to my websites and on clickwebs.com and a couple others, I'm gonna put links to this and you'll see them on there. 
and you'll be able to get discounts on shipping and the machines from this. Now I hear a noise behind me. It's Cat! He's in the box! He's a box cat! You'll be seeing lots of cat and breeder and stuff and you've probably seen him in the best of clips and Cat showed you his butt and all that good stuff. So, that's the prizes. How do you get... This one's easy. You just guess. You'll be the first person that guess whose coach it was. Easy, right? Second person? Well, you might get something here. I don't know. I'm going to have a second place runner-up thing for someone. How do you get the big bonus thing that goes with this? Now, which prize is worth more? I don't know. Are you going to get this exact soda stream machine? I don't know. I'm going to buy you one. I'm going to do site to store at Walmart. And you're going to go on and you get in your little car and go boot and down there and you pick up your soda stream machine. Just like that. This here is going to cost me 25 30 bucks to ship. So, I had questions. Didn't know how I was going to do it. Questions are this. In this film, what did I say that I bred before I bred beagles? So, somewhere in this here thing that you've watched, you've seen that. And the second question will be, what stock did I buy in the best of clips? So, in the middle of this somewhere was the best of clips. I bought a stock. What stock was it? So, what stock did I buy? And what did I say I used to breed before beagles? Now that's the two main things you need to know. The third thing you need to know was the first thing, which is whose coach it was. So that's three things you need to know. Now there's one more thing that's going to qualify you, and you're the winner. Last time, sometime in the last, oh, 15 videos. 074 for some time in the future, by the way. And I pulled three of them. I pulled three balls, just like that. It's better than pulling two balls. You pull two balls, you could have some pain and injury going on. You pull three, you got a contest. So, I pulled these out. I need to know the balls that I pulled out. Now, don't tell me the balls that I pulled out. That's just not polite. But that is what I'm going to need to know. I'm going to need to know... In fact, I'm going to make sure... I did the same thing I did right now. For next time, this one is N34. And I know I'm going to have somebody that gives me these three balls. And says these are the ones that are the winning ones. G58. These are for some time in the future. And I did the same thing at some time during a random video. When I'm doing cars, I have this thing in the trunk sometimes and I pull balls out. I'm just going down the road, I pull balls out. Just like that. I mean, I'm telling you. It's so cool. I mean, you've seen this in the video. For one dollar, I'm able to pull my balls out everywhere I go and nobody can say nothing about it. Now that, that's some cool stuff right there. So, prizes, prizes, prizes. I'll give you one more time going over this. Check out my websites, clickwebs.com. That one's up. You can check it out now. And not only that, until the 31st, you can give your input on YouTube and tell me right about this here website. Um, lots of other websites to check out. Hardner. It's just hardner.com. Stinking million dollar name. And I've got just my stuff on it. Can you even read that? You can now. Hardner.com. Beaglespocket.com. Tinybeagles.com. All kinds of good websites to check out. And oneownercarguy.com for really cool, classic, unique one owner cars. Serialmarshmallows.com, and you can get these free marshmallows here that I'm talking about in the contest. You can buy them right here on serialmarshmallows.com. And other than that, nathanradislaw.org. Check that one out. And all my sites pretty much have a My Other Websites tab. And if you click that, if you click it, if you click that one, it'll usually pull this up to where you can go to a bunch of them or you can scroll the page and read about them. So, check that out. I'm going to go over this one more time, tell you the contest. Contest is, guess whose coach it was? Bam! You win all this stuff. Just like that. Not my machine, I'll tell you that. Then, two more things. Guess the beagle. What I bred before the beagle. What did I breed before beagles? And then the other thing was, what stock did I buy in the best of clips here in this video? And the last thing that you need to know to win the Soda Stream machine is what three balls I pulled in one of my previous videos. They were all pulled at the same time, and I'll give you a little clue about it. There was something just a little bit ironic and kind of lucky about the way it all happened. So, 
that's that. I thank you for watching. Thank you very much for um, commenting, subscribing, liking, for being here on YouTube. It's a blast. I love it. And it's definitely fun making movies. It's fun talking to everybody on here. Make sure and comment. I do try and answer all my comments and talk to everybody. It's fun. It's what I'm doing on here. Other than that, thanks for watching. I'm going to clip another thing in here because I think I got everything, but I'm not sure. Thousandth video. I hope to see you in another thousand. And it's going to be a lot quicker than this one came up because I'm uploading a lot more stuff. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. OneOwnerCarGuy.com That was it. So, don't guess in this video. It won't help you any. You're not going to win anything. You need to wait for the video where I go around that thing again and show the contest. And you'll notice in this one it was cleaned up. In the one I'm going to show, it wasn't. Little clues in both ones and stuff. Make sure and guess. You're going to love it. Thank you for watching. Thank you once again. Thank you for making Thousandth Video possible. And other than that, one owner car guy, stockgambles.com, hardner.com, beaglespocket.com. Check them out. Lots of websites on there. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you in another thousand here for sure.